Have you ever experienced a problem with your mesh or geometry while modeling an object with Blender? I'm talking about problems such as unnecessary geometry, bad normals, face orientation issues, or maybe some messed up topology. Honestly, no one wants to experience those problems, right? Because these problems might cause some future difficulties when dealing with the mesh. It might even make you start from scratch, and this will disrupt your workflow, taking away a lot of your time and energy. But there is an add-on that can help fix this problem, and it is called Instant Clean. It functions as a mesh cleaner for Blender, and it is essentially a single-click mesh cleaner add-on with a simple preset system, which is great. This will help you avoid all the problems we mentioned earlier and it will save a lot of your time by automating the mesh cleaning process when you import models, helping you concentrate more on the creative part of the project. Generally speaking, the add-on has seven different features that you can take advantage of. The first one combines all the features together, and it allows you to fix everything with your mesh, and you can do this at once with just one click. The second feature is the preset system. Here you can save some presets depending on your needs and use them again whenever you need them. The other features we're going to talk about are considered additional features. The first additional feature is called Mesh Repair, and it allows you to eliminate and fix most of the possible errors and damages in your mesh. The next feature tackles the problem of normals issues, where you can fix face orientation issues, clear custom normals, auto smooth, and more. Another cool feature is the Geometry Dissolve, and here you can get rid of all the unnecessary geometry that you don't need on your project, I mean your object, while keeping the same shape you first had, which means you'll be having a more clean and simpler geometry. The feature that I like most about this add-on is called Author Topology. This feature is an absolute game changer, because it can save you a ton of time. Basically, it allows you to change the topology of your mesh to the style that you need, and you can convert from triangles to quads or vice versa, and you can select the mesh of the changing topology. The last feature is called Clean Object Data. This one enables you to get rid of unused material slots and empty vertex groups which will make your files more organized and cleaner. This will save you time of course and will ease up your workflow. Now, when it comes to how to use the add-on, it is really simple and easy. You just have to download it first, install it inside Blender, enable it, and voila! you will see the new window pop up in the M panel. To start using the add-on, you need to select the object that you want to apply the changes to. Go to the edit mode and then press on the features that you want to apply. And as we said earlier, the first feature combines all the features together. And to apply it, you will see a big button called clean. Once you press it, the changes will be applied in a matter of seconds. And to apply the other features, you will see a play button beside each one. You just have to press it and apply that specific feature. You can also change some settings and preferences in each feature. For example, in the normals feature, you can change the recalculation method, either inside or outside. Also, another example, in the dissolve feature, you can change the value of the max angle. Generally speaking, each feature has its own unique settings and preferences, and these features you can change and play around with as much as you want. Adding to that, you can also save your preferred settings as a preset so you can use it in another time or maybe on other projects. So after talking about how to use the add-on, the first thing you will notice is that the add-on is extremely fast and it works with any mesh and any geometry no matter how big or how complicated it is. Another good thing about it is that it is super efficient and it works really well and gives good results. On the other side, I honestly couldn't find any downsides since the add-on works well and offers an efficient solution to the problems we have and the problems we discussed before. Overall, the add-on is quick and does a great job, and I highly recommend it. In my opinion, this add-on can soon become a requirement for all Blender artists, especially if you want to save yourself a lot of time and effort. If you are interested, you will find the necessary links in the description. I hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and you can also subscribe to this channel to stay updated with the 3D software news and the CG industries in general. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.